I do speech against hate and I get condemned for hate speech because the forces of evil practice inverse speech. Here it says, I speech against hate. What is normal has become forbidden and what is forbidden has become normal and then they make it legal and not allowed to speak against it or to speak against them anymore. How convenient for the devil and his helpers to be portrayed as neutral, clean and innocent. It says, I speech against hate. And this here is hate speech. And I speech against hate. How convenient to have all the evil practices made legal and generally accepted as the law. So here it says, set phasers to kill the patriarchy. This is hate speech. And I, Homie Ross, I speech against hate. And this is the Star Trek Delta symbol. And this here is the symbol for feminism, for the she males in pink. And do you know what phasers are? I'll show you what it is. It's a weapon. So using a weapon to kill the patriarchy, which means to kill the man, it's hate speech. And I get condemned for hate speech. Well, how is this possible? I speech against hate speech. It's the other way around. And, you know, this is an appeal for violence. And it should get them in prison. But they get all protected by the law. Uh, look. I show you what phasers are. Here it says phaser from Wikipedia. A phaser is a fictional weapon, a gun in the Star Trek universe. Yeah, there was the Star Trek symbol. The phaser effect in electronics. So it's it's a, a an array theon phaser. It's a directed energy weapon, which I already have nowadays. Eh? So this is real, yeah. And also it says here, phaser is an insecticide containing the active ingredient endosulfan. So, like Zyklon B. And I've proven you that the pink list killers are behind the genocide on the jaywalkers. You know, and now they're doing it again. Why? Because the orthodox jay runners, you know, they ran away from Egypt and from Rome. They always ran away. Which was a good thing, you know. I, I mean, I won't blame them for that. And um, so they used the Zyklon B was an insecticide to kill them. And uh, there was the uh, the Bunte Deutsche Mädels and Jutta Rüdiger, all pink list killers. And now they do it again, you know. They want to use again an insecticide to kill the patriarchy, because for those orthodox J runners, the patriarchy is important because a woman doesn't see the danger. You know, she's a birdie birdie. She wants warmth and food for the nest. This is how we were made. The men are there to protect the nest. This is how it's made. We cannot change this. This is how it is. So this is very evil. It's an appeal for violence. It's an appeal for genocide, again, by these pink list killers. And when I talk about it, because I speech against hate, I get condemned for hate speech. Now, what's going on here? I do only speech against hate. And I get persecuted for a quarter of a century. And my children, too. The forces of evil hitting me 
and my family with their pharaonic mace saying we're gonna hit you just as long until you won't contradict us anymore and until you'll repeat the narrative we'll tell you to. Therefore YouTube deleted my last video on my channel Gyuri of January the 11th 2023 because I speak against hate and the forces of hate and evil do not want me to. So here it says hate speech for my film Swiss made Ukraine killers. The Ukraine killers were Swiss made and it's a fact. I mean I, I speak against this hate. They, they, they're killing Ukrainians with the help of Swiss made articles and they know it. Here it says January the 11th 2023 for a hate speech. What a shame really, what a shame. Expires on April the 11th. So for three months can't make any videos here or I shouldn't. And here it says here. This was another one here. Appeal rejected of course. And I submitted a an appeal on the same day. I pierce right through them and my tongue is as sharp as a sword which makes them afraid. I immediately re-uploaded that last deleted video with a lot of new and important information on the brighton.com free speech video platform in USA America. So here is my Brighton channel, same name. Here is the icon. There's a big lion and a little cat with a big shadow behind. So with a lot of potential, a little cat with a lot of potential. And here is the video. Here you can see the Knights Templars logo of the Swiss High Templar command. And here the, uh, the GPS um, for the uh, Russian drones, uh, Swiss GPS. And here's the title, Swiss made Ukraine killers, video censored on YouTube. So here you can see the famous crossroads to the left, it's evil and hate speech. And to the right, it's free speech and good. And I speech against hate. That's all I ever done. I haven't done anything else. I got my channels removed and my videos removed. So these are the crossroads which, about which many famous musicians have talked about. And many have taken the road towards evil in order to get famous. And to my big surprise, the next day after the upload and consecutive censorship, YouTube had reinstalled my deleted video without a word without any notice and without an excuse. I just found it back accidentally and so did some of you, but most of you won't ever see the video and it's important information as you all got a notice that the video got deleted because of hate speech. But in fact, I speech against hate. You listen carefully, YouTube and the Swissies and the Pinkley's killers. I speech 
against hate. So you just lay down and stop this. So I herewith invite you to watch it anyway, because I promise you, you don't want to miss its valuable information. So here it is. YouTube has put it back. My appeal got approved. So six days ago, they put it back. And the video I made seven days ago, the title Swiss Made Ukraine Killers on the same channel here, Gure. Now, who is responsible for attacking me and deleting my film? Although YouTube is responsible for taking my video off, they didn't initiate the illegal censoring of my video because otherwise they wouldn't have reinstalled my video when they realized after watching that I don't do any hate speech and that in fact I do speech against hate. And well, in the last video, my speech was against the hate of the pink list killers and their kill the patriarchy hate speech. And in fact, they do the same as neo Nazis do and a lot of Muslims. Instead of saying kill the or do something against the um, uh, the jaywalkers or the jayrunners, they say um, do something against the Zionists because then it's um, legally not really um, attackable. So these ones here, the pink list killers, they do the same thing. Instead of saying kill all the men, they say kill the patriarchy with ray guns. Can you imagine ray guns? It's like they have an alliance with the aliens. Oh, it is sort of very alien to me, the whole stuff they do eh? with their phasers and ray guns. And my speech against hate was against the hate of the Swissies and their hate speech against immigrants and their three white Swissy sheep beating up the individual black sheep. And my speech in the deleted video was against the Swiss collaboration with dictator Putin, helping him to murder Ukrainian civilians through the Swiss military industrial complex. So one of these two groups you can see here, and maybe both simultaneously, must have organized themselves in a Swiss pink list killer conspiracy against Homie Ross to massively smash the hate speech button in order to destroy the video by an organized group of people sharing the same motive for this felony. And yes, undermining the US Constitution and its First Amendment in a conspiracy under US law is in fact a felony and punishable with a prison sentence. So I would like YouTube to find out who exactly is raping the hate speech option, which was meant to protect minorities and was not meant to aggress and terrorize individuals by these very same minorities who in fact 
can apparently defend themselves very well. And without the help of YouTube's censorship terror, which is a useless tool anyway, as the evidence of this criminal application of the YouTube hate speech tool herewith fully proves. And YouTube, Swissy, and the Pink List Killers, please read with me here. I read out loud. I speech against hate. Did you get it? The problem is that these so called poor minorities have the best lawyers. They are highly organized and know how to use nepotism by using members of their community on key positions into their own favors with which they are premeditatively crushing the individual. So who in fact is here? the poor minority. Huh? I've been telling you for years that I'm blacklisted by the Swiss and their Nazi authorities and that I'm pinklisted by the pink list killers. And as soon as I make a pretty tough video against their hate speech against humanity, I get attacked and censored. It's perfect mob rule. I have no other words for it. So what more proofs do you need that I'm blacklisted by the Swiss and pinklisted by the pink list killers? It's an absolute disaster that those who commit hate speech are being given the tools to censor the ones who speak out against hate speech. I urge YouTube to reconsider their absolutely useless hate speech tool policy because it's entirely counterproductive. So please, YouTube, read with me and I speak out loud. I speech against hate. Did you get that? Quod erat demonstrandum, in Latin meaning, which was to be demonstrated. Q E D. What had to be proven has been proven. So, Swissy, you carefully read with me. Q E D. Quod erat demonstrandum. What had to be proven has been proven. A Swissy.